Would you like to try an application developed for the seniors in El Paso? Or do you want to get assistance from your phone for your mobility needs? You can do that and more with Urban Connector application. We are researchers from the University of Texas at El Paso and we developed this application to cater mobility needs of seniors in El Paso. In this video, we will show you how to use Urban Connector. So let's get started. To download the Urban Connector to your mobile device, open up Google Play. Tap on the search bar and type in Urban Connector. When you see the program in the search results, tap the install button to download it. When the download is completed, find the app in your mobile device's main menu and open the application. When you start the application for the first time, it will ask you about your preferences before starting the actual use of the application. First, you will select the font size. You can increase or decrease the font size with the triangles on the screen. The next step is selecting the language. You can select English or Spanish from the list of options. The third step is to select if you have any of the listed impairments. The final step is to enter your home address. Entering home address is optional. If you do not want to enter it, you can just skip this part by tapping continue. When you assign a home address, the related black and white icon turns colorful. You can now tap on the home icon on the frequent places menu. When you tap this button, it will give you the route to your home address. Likewise, you can add addresses of your family members and friends from the frequent places menu. Addresses can be added manually or by just tapping on the map. When you tap on the top left corner of the screen, you can see the home menu. From this menu, you can select Transportation Services menu. Within the Transportation Services, you can reach the web pages of the Sun Metro, the City of El Paso, and other relevant places. This project is a collaboration between UTEP and the City of El Paso Parks and Recreation Department. Thanks for watching.